as a startup, you have finite resources and you can't be kind of chasing your tail or, or you know, going off down, down paths. And, and with tools like Fresh Paint and Mixed Panel, we can make much, much more informed decisions. Uh, when we release something, we can quickly see you know, what, how that release went, if, if folks are using that feature, what may or may not be going you know, well or, or not going well, and, and make adjustments uh, quickly accordingly. So now we have all that visibility uh, that we maybe didn't have before. So auto tracking was was key. You know, for me, it was a, a a big big reason why we went with Fresh Paint. You know, when you, I was the first product person coming into to, to this organization. I'm trying to understand what's important, what's not, and the beautiful thing about auto tracking is I can implement it with very limited you know engineering work and start getting a bunch of insights. And maybe I don't get all the precision events or the things that happen you know, on the back end. But at a high level, I can very quickly get, get a bunch of key events that our user act, users are taking within our application and, and, and get a much more comprehensive picture of, of what's important, what are our users doing. Um, and so not having to, you know, not having to spend a bunch of engineering to get analytics up front is a huge win. And so now our organization sees the value in the analytics. Uh, and it's, it's much more easy for me to say, hey, we need to implement kind of these more back-end precision events to get, to get more rich details. But I've already proven and shown that, hey, we have all this rich information and there's value in us having this information. Uh, and so, you know, stakeholders, executives can, can see, see the value and benefit. They can see that their engineering, you know, wasn't, is not having to spend time writing custom scripts to get to get information about, about how users are using your product. And so auto tracking was key in, in just uh, taking us from zero to one and getting value really quickly uh, you know, from an analytics platform. One thing that's great about Fresh Paint is, is we can send events to different places. We can choose which events to send and which properties to send to, to different, different you know, each place. So, for example, mix panel, we use that for product analytics. We're, we're trying to deeply understand user behavior, so we'll send a lot of events there. We'll send page views, clicks, all kinds of things to track that user, user journey, understand the behaviors that are key for, key for our providers and, and our patients. Then we use that data to kind of inform our decisions about uh, you know, how we onboard customers, what features we want to build. The combination of, of Fresh Paint and Mixed Panel was really, you know, useful. W one, one thing as a healthcare company is you have, you know, users like providers who are your users, uh, doctors, nurses, staff, and they're all using your product. Um, and then, but they all work for an organization or a practice, a clinic, uh, and so, one thing that was really powerful about Fresh Paint is that we could take advantage of Mixed Panel's group properties. So we're able to see not only at a, a user level what users are doing, but we can say, hey, at a practice level, what is this practice doing? How many notes is this practice you know, creating every day? And so Fresh Paint has a nice, nice way of handling those group properties where we can send it all to Fresh Paint, but then still take, take advantage of those rich kind of Mixed Panel features like group properties. And so that marriage was kind of very easy. It was very simple for, for us to set it up. Yeah, it was, it was just easy. <laughs> Time machine tools, like a really awesome uh, feature of Fresh Paint. Uh, what it allows us to do is, is kind of retroactively go back and see you know, how many users have clicked a certain button or event. So a lot of product analytics tool, they'll only start tracking when you send, uh, send events. The nice thing about the auto tracking and the Time Machine is that Together, it starts. It's tracking all these events from the get-go. So, if three months from now I decide, oh, I I really want to know how how patients interacted with this this section of wrap or this piece that we haven't, you know, started tracking, I can go back using the auto tracking, create an event for that, and then retroactively push those events to mix panel. So I have all that historical data that I didn't didn't have before, and I can make an informed decision about based on the last like three months of usage today, instead of having to just start sending events today and having to wait two weeks to make that decision, I can get all that, make that decision right away.